If you're telling yourself Adderall doesn't work when I have my period, you are not wrong. There is a relationship between hormones and stimulants. While estrogen and progesterone are typically associated with the reproductive system, they can impair brain function and flux. Changing hormones also can impact how a stimulant is metabolized. Both hormones drop before your period, which can worsen your ADHD and interfere with your medication. A quick Google search of terms like Adderall and menstrual cycle will unearth plenty of women who are looking for answers. Dr. Patricia Quinn, who studies the impact of ADHD on women at length, knows this phenomenon all too well. The author of 100 Questions and Answers about Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder in Women and Girls clocks the impact around the week before your period. I tell all women, you need to look for this for two consecutive months and pick out five symptoms. Rate them each day for two months, one being a good attention span, four being terrible attention span, one being in a good mood, and four being depressed, Dr. Quinn explains in a totally ADD webinar. If you see anything getting worse before your period, you may want to increase the dose of your medicine for that week your stimulant medicine, but you also may want to think about evening out the hormones of your menopausal. If you are considering adjusting your Adderall or supplementing your hormones, please consult a doctor. A 2016 study published in the medical journal Pharmacopediology and Drug Safety echoed Dr. Quinn's observations. The college-aged women in that study, who were not on birth control, tended to take more central nervous system CNS medications at the onset of their periods, particularly Adderall. If you don't want to take more Adderall because of your menstrual cycle, there are options. Therapist and renowned author Sari Solden recommends that you plan ahead for a difficult time when you know that your period's arriving soon. This isn't the time to be hard on yourself or be an overachiever. Instead, practice self-compassion and care. If you don't want to look at adjusting your medications on those days, you have to then accommodate your life on those days, Solden said. So knowing just in advance that you're going to have a harder time can sometimes help just knowing that you don't want to overschedule yourself on that day. You want to make sure you have plenty of rest, plenty of sleep, and as little stress as possible.